with Shaber 1000 here. Today I'm going to try a meat stick I've never had before. Or, well, I don't think I've had before. Monkey got it for me at the Dollar Tree. It was $1.25, of course. Okay, so this is hot chili pepper and lime flavored. She bought me a couple other ones too. There was another one of these and I got two Tabasco ones. I've had the Tabasco ones before, but I've never had this one before. So I thought I'd give it a try. Inspired by the intensity of Takis, Takis? I can't never say that word. Anyway, here's the nutrition facts on it. I don't know if you guys can see them. Okay, so I'm going to give this a shot. Best by December 22nd, 2022. It's a meat stick. It should last longer than that. But that's best by. That doesn't mean it's going to spoil, you know, December 23rd. It's going to be no good. That's not what that means. These things will last forever. So let's give this a try. Just a quick upload for you today. Okay. Oh, it's um, Cattleman's Cut is the name of the brand. I've had their stuff before. Now, let me tell you something. This, <laughs> Monkey's got to try this. This is very good meat sticking. And if you guys buy meat sticks, you know how expensive they're getting. I made my own beef jerky one time. I think it's in the Chef Shea Bear episode on that playlist. But, um... Uh, I'm going to do it again here soon, but this is, I've never made the meat sticks for, well, since I've been down here, I haven't made the meat sticks, but I have made them before in the past, like probably 10 or 12 years ago at least, but these are very good, and they are worth $1.25. Two thumbs up, five out of five stars on this. Um... I know it says hot chili pepper, ooh, spin, and lime flavored, but I can taste the lime. I can taste the hot chili peppers, but I mean, it's there. It's not overwhelming. I mean, even if you don't care for spicy stuff, I think you can, I think you would like this. Now, I understand there's some people, when I do these spicy, um, reviews I know some people's stomach or you know health conditions or whatever they can't have that and I know that but if you can and you like your stuff this is perfect I mean this is uh, this would be great to take fishing hunting camping whatever throw a couple in your pack stop for a break take you a couple bites man good job monkey thank you I have another one in there too I'm going to eat this one, but I'm going to let her try the other one I've got. She's messaging me right now, as a matter of fact. She had to take her mom to the doctor. We thought they might, because um, the nurse came yesterday and wanted her to go to the emergency room. Well, they, she, she didn't want to go, so we kept a close eye on her. And then they did blood work this morning and then now she took her to the uh, to the doctor so we thought the doctor was just going to send her to the hospital but apparently they didn't so she said she was going to the bank now she just messaged me she's going to go wash the car so I said okay anyway guys um, hope y'all had a had a great Memorial Day weekend we had a great weekend the boat it did break down for the first time since we've had it I used the trolling motor to get home or to get back to the ramp. That wasn't a big deal. So, you know, we didn't have to get towed in or anything. But I do consider it a breakdown because it did just stall out. It did get hot. I didn't want to restart it after that. So I just used the trolling motor and brought us in. We were only a few miles out. So a trolling motor brought us in fine. 
and excuse me I went I, I was uploading that video well what was it yeah I was uploading it and it was in 4k so that little short video took like 40 minutes so while it was doing that I went out and I found the bolt <laughs> the little screw the little tiny bolt and I got it running and about that time that was only like five minutes I came in and told monkey she's like you want to take it out and try it out <laughs> so I was like yeah sure so that's why you see you know update the boat is fixed because it was actually just uploading when when uh, when I got that done it just finished uploading and I was making my thumbnail so that's why you see that so that's how that worked out so seemed to run pretty good after that uh, so anyway guys again stay safe appreciate you watching Shea Bear admit the man of legend gone for now stay tuned for more videos and we'll see you in the next one bye bye guys and take care